All right, guys, today we actually have some very interesting stuff. We actually have a lot of stuff today, so we're going to get straight into it. First up, we have this this pretty fast match loading intake. I think, I mean, it's a it's a top to, it's like a horizontal intake, so usually you don't expect, expect those to be super fast, but, you know, they have a, po have a poly piece on it, and they have a, it's like rollers, and they would roll this super fast, even though someone said... So it's, someone said slow. <laughs> okay, I guess someone knows I'm recording. <laughs> someone just said hi Luke, OMG, hi Luke. That's crazy timing. Anyways, um, oh yeah, I'm. Let's try to hit 10k. That'd be really cool. So if you guys want to help me on that, that'd be amazing. I'm gonna use one in eight tier. I think it's nice. Alright, anyways, under this one, drive motors decided to leave, and like very very slow. Mhm. Mm I mean, it's nice. This is a really nice representation of kind of what it looks like i think this is a little a little ambitious where we're with it holding this many but i'm sure it can hold at like six pretty pretty consistently inside right and then of course there's a there's a back uh trap door for it to go this is a pretty nice design i'm gonna give this one an eight tier as well okay finished that's jonathan by the way and then sebas finished dt with linear odom and spring leaf odom very nice. I like the this one a lot. I think this is just a very new product from last season, and it's able to really capture the ingenuity of the vexed of <laughs> vex high school kind of increasing. Very nice. I'm gonna give this, uh, actually I'm gonna give this an A tier. I'm missing A tier. Yeah, feedback on the drive. Pretty nice. I think you can do better. I think you can add a chat, another support here. So I'm gonna give this one a B tier. Or and then this one here. Wow. This is a very very long very long design okay so they kind of take a very far route back so I, I, i'm guessing this one hold a lot more than the other ones um i don't know it's interesting i like it i think uh i think this has a lot of potential i see a lot of potential here but i don't know how you're going to score on two different levels with that design on the top but i think if you figure it out with a hood then you can do pretty well so i'm gonna give this one a b tier i think you're you're getting somewhere all right, we have, a, we have a bucket. We have a we have a uh, pretty large basket here, so that's nice. Um, I'm gonna give this one a B tier as well. Coming along, coming along. Oh, oh wow, 3D printed. Interesting. It's a oh camera mount. Oh, that's cool. 3D printed camera mount. Unfortunately, all banned, but that's cool. I'm gonna give this one an A tier. I'm excited to see what happens. And. We are actually going to rate this robot in three days. So this is going to be interesting. Um, this is a Vex U team. Um, Skiers, S K E R S, and the robot took a lot of inspiration from some pr other designs, of course, right? With a hood front to back, but you know it's the first one you see kind of being put into practice and very nice scoring very efficient and you know, not too much velocity entering so it doesn't get to push too far and it kind of makes me feel like uh feel like over under all over again with the with the front <laughs> um sprocket intake band intake so it's very very interesting i think you should add a back plate to this a three wide would be perfect looking at you using these two uh, these two wide C channels. I think a three wide will be just perfect on the back here. Uh, it looks looks nice, and of course they have the little tongue mech that Little Will designed this early this season, where it's able to you know grab the the balls out of or just let the balls like um, literally just fall out roll out of the pipes, which works pretty well. However, I do I do think that might be a little challenging to align in auto but maybe not maybe not for some teams but yeah very nice i think your battery placement might get this this wire shredded but other than that it's a it's pretty nice pretty nice design i think i think uh this is a pretty simple early season design i think not really i don't know i don't, I don't know how easy it'll be to drive a front to back because from the previous couple seasons what we've seen especially in spin up front to backs although they yes they did there were some that made dome, 
most spots that made dome were all front to front. Of course, at the end of the season, of course, most spots were in the in, like, at like were just front to front. But you know, I'm looking at this one eight here. Solid, solid. First instinct of the season looks clean. However, it's really weird how you are how you are putting these bands inside. Like, never do that. <laughs> this is definitely gonna snap. These bands are definitely gonna snap as soon as this starts spinning. I I would 100% recommend putting these sprockets a tiny bit inside, like one half inch spacer inside, and then putting another space or sprocket on the outside, and then just chaining it on the outside instead. And then have this these sprockets dedicated for bands, right? Like how most teams would do it. So I'm gonna give this one a a, a D tier. Not my favorite design. All right, Orion six one two one B. Another drivetrain design. A lot of drivetrains. People are starting their builds. I think I rated this one. I'm gonna be real. Actually, I don't. I, actually, I didn't. I'm lying. I'm gonna give this one a B tier. Not really anything special. Other drivetrain. This one's built though. Nice. It looks like it's a little curvy. Maybe it's just how controls and stuff not really it's so so fast it's pretty clean i like the battery placement uh cut your shafts first of all cut, cut your shafts and then i mean you don't there's no space for any odom or anything so i'm guessing you're going to use either pid or something more advanced i'm going to get on a beat here all right colin <laughs> this is funny <laughs> that, is, that is funny this is a you know is it going to go in as smoothly when there's a ball on top? I'm not sure, but uh, does this does this work? Kinda. I'm going to give this a, a C tier. I don't think it's going to be effective, but it's cool. Alright, one more. Hi, Luke. Oh, they, they, they know I'm recording. <laughs> that's funny. Anyways, but yeah, that's a, that's not, that's pretty, pretty much... A lot of this stuff. Oh, this is a new one. That one's. I don't like this one. This one's uh, getting a getting a C tier. Uh oh yeah, and then this CAD here as well. Nice. Hmm. Oh, I think this is the one that. This is the CAD that that we saw, uh, further down. I didn't realize, but this uh this is very interesting. Five point five watt motor placement here on the very bottom, facing up. I kind of like that. You know the way the motors like inside the drivetrain. That's that's interesting. That's really nice. It's the same one as this one. Yeah, and the motors are just just uh, very tucked away there in the corner. Nice. Um, that's about it. Uh, please subscribe so I can hit 10k. Uh, so I look cooler. And that's a, about it. Thank you guys for watching, and see you guys like tomorrow.